The Easy Interactive Tools is a basic annotation program available from the Epson website. If you are on the Windows platform, you can check and see if the software is already installed on your computer by clicking on Start, choose Programs, then if the software is installed, you will see Epson Projector, Easy Interactive Tools. If the software is not installed, you can download the most current version of the software by going to epson.com slash brightlink downloads. On the page, you can click on your projector model. Then click on Drivers and Downloads. On the next page, you can locate the Easy Interactive Tools for Windows 32 or Windows 64-bit operating systems. 32 or 64-bit refers to the way a computer's processor handles information. If you are unsure which version you are running, you can always click on the Start button, click Control Panel, click System and Maintenance or Security, and then click System. Under System, you can see here I have a 32-bit system. I'll click to close that window and go back to my browser. I'll then click to open the 32-bit link, click on Easy Interactive Tools, and then click Download Now. Next, you'll be able to enter your email address to receive driver alerts, e-newsletters, and special offers from Epson. Once you have that entered, you can click Accept to accept the terms and conditions and start your download. Once you've downloaded the software, you can locate it on your computer. Mine is sitting on my desktop. I'll double click to open it up. In the first dialog box, we can choose the language and click Next. The following dialog box that appears, we can click Next as well. I'll click the radio button to accept the terms of the license agreement and then click Next. Finally, I'll click and place a check in each box, register to startup, and to add a shortcut to the desktop, and then click Install. Once the software is installed, we can click Finish to leave the installer. You can then open the Easy Interactive Tools by going to Start, Choose Programs, Epson Projector, Easy Interactive Tools.